Today we are going to make random alligator that you can enjoy random games with your friends. Building this creation, you will learn how to write condition codes for buttons, how to control the motor angles, and how to write codes using the random module. So, what do you think you need to make the random alligator? You will need a network and a battery for the setup module, a motor controller and a motor module connected to two motors for the output module, and a button for the input module. Prepare a basic block, a shoe block, two horns, two pin adapters, and a wire from the accessory. Then bring any materials you need to decorate your alligator. These are all you need. Before you start coding, let's check the coding map to figure out the code structure. At first, the alligator's mouth is open. If you push a button, it changes the motor angles which open and close the alligator's mouth randomly. If you're lucky, its mouth will stay open. If you fail, the motor angles will change, closing the alligator's mouth, then opening it again. If you're unlucky, the alligator will bite your finger. Now let's start coding. Run Modi Studio and enter a name for a new project. Connect Modi to the computer and check that the Modi connected to the module map is recognized properly. Now it's time to write condition codes for the buttons. Drag an if block from the block palette to the code editor and select the button module in the condition box. Then select click. Enter, equal, and true. You will have completed the condition code for if you press a button. To move the alligator's mouth randomly, add a random block and a number block of the module box to the module map. Then place the random block under the if code. The random block is a variable block that randomly selects a number within the designated range. You can set the minimum and maximum values between 0 and 100. I have set 1 as the minimum value and 3 as the maximum value. Now whenever you click a button, the number 1, 2, or 3 will be randomly created. To return to the default status, place the math block under the IF code. Enter number 0 in the first box and random 0 in the next box. We are now going to write operation codes for numbers 0, 1, 2, and 3. Number zero is the default status, which holds the alligator's mouth open. Number one is fail. And number two and three are pass. If you fail, the alligator closes its mouth, then opens it again according to the default status. The alligator's mouth consists of a motor and horns connected to the motor axis. You can therefore move its mouth by setting motor angles. So, let's write the default status code for number zero first. Drag an if block and enter number zero. Then place the motor module under it and select angle from among angle, speed, and torque in the first box. The angle refers to the motor rotation angles. The motor axis rotates according to the set angles. You can select a number between 0 and 100 clockwise. For number 0, 
which is the default state where the alligator's mouth is open, I set 50. 50 as the default motor angles. Then I connected the delay block and entered 500 milliseconds to maintain the angle for a moment. Next, let's write a code for number one. Add an if block and enter a code indicating that number zero is equal to one. Then place the motor module under the if code and enter the motor angles. Change the default motor angles from 50, 50 to 20, 80, which closes the alligator's mouth. Connect a delay block to maintain the status for two seconds. To go back to the default status, drag math and enter a code indicating that number zero is equal to zero. The reason that you should set 20, 80 for the motor angle is that the two motors should face in opposite directions rather than in the same direction. When the angles of the two motors are set to 50, 50, they rotate by 50 clockwise. The two motors should rotate in opposite directions to each other, right? After setting 50, 50 for the motor angles, pull out the horns and insert them again in one direction according to the angles of the default status. To operate the rotation axis of the motor as the alligator's mouth is closed, the left side motor and the right side motor should move clockwise and counterclockwise respectively. In other words, you should set 80, which is the reference angle 50 plus 30 for the left side motor, and set 20, which is the reference angle 50 minus 30 for the right side motor in order for the motors to move in the same direction. Next, we will write a code for number two and three. As random two and three correspond to the same operation, we will write only one if code for them. Add an if block and set number two. Do not click then just yet, but click on the plus icon next to it. A new box is then created at the bottom of the screen. A new box is then created at the bottom of the screen. Here, select OR and enter 3. Under this condition, set the default angles 50. 50 for the motor angles and add a delay block for 500 milliseconds to maintain the status for a moment. Finally, add a number 0 code to finish it with number 0. You will have then finished writing all of the codes. Now upload the codes to Modi.
Why don't you make your own Modi random game based on the random luck you learned today? M-O-D-I Modi